This is Insider Medicine in depth. With the increasing popularity of acupuncture, cases of infection spread by this treatment are also on the rise, according to an editorial published online ahead of print in the British Medical Journal. Here are some ways to minimize your risk of being infected during an acupuncture treatment. Be sure your practitioner uses only disposable needles. Make sure your practitioner disinfects your skin before inserting needles. Be sure your practitioner uses only sterile equipment such as cotton swabs, towels or hot pack covers. To date, more than 50 cases of bacterial infections causing pus-filled lesions have been reported to be associated with acupuncture and experts from the University of Hong Kong believe this is just the tip of the iceberg. Usually, the infection is caused by failing to adequately disinfect the skin before inserting an acupuncture needle. These infections are usually limited to the skin and surrounding tissue but rarely can spread, causing joint destruction, multi-organ failure, flesh-eating disease, paralysis, and even death. Hepatitis B and antibiotic-resistant bacterial infections have been spread by acupuncture needles, and there is a theoretical risk that they could cause the spread of hepatitis C and even HIV. Recently, experts have discovered a new clinical entity they have called acupuncture mycobacteriosis. It is a skin infection caused by acupuncture that starts as a red lump at the site where the needle was inserted. Over weeks or months, it can develop into a large pustule, abscess, or ulcer. So far, two large outbreaks of this condition are known to have affected more than 70 people. Today's research highlights the risk of the spread of infection during acupuncture. If you develop any signs of skin irritation or infection during the days, weeks, or months after undergoing acupuncture, consult your healthcare professional. For Insider Medicine In-Depth, I'm Dr. Kelly Schweitzer.